Clark, this isn't about Cadigan. It's bigger than any of us. Don't make me do this. So, we now know what happened at the end of episode 13 of season seven. I'm sorry. Me too. Bellamy has died. I know it's a devastating loss, and I know it's a hard story, and I know lots of you are probably upset. I am too. Bob will be missed, and was an amazing uh, part of the show, and, and clearly has a bright future ahead of him. This is an episode where we will see that death really, really landing for all of our characters. Before we talk about it, though, I have to introduce a couple of people. Episode 714, Sort of Homecoming, was written by Sean Crouch, his second episode for us this season. And it was directed by the amazing actress and director, Jessica Harmon. What is it? What happened? You know, I do know that it was an emotional episode. Very. Following a surprising, almost last minute adjustment to the previous episode. Um, and everybody was really wrung out from it. And so to have you there um, was, I think, probably really palliative in, in a lot of ways. You know, you're not really a visiting director. You're a home, you're a hometown girl. I really did feel like the little, the, uh, the family really came together. Bars open. Uh, is it safe? It was never safe. It, a lot of times when, it, when an actor directs, you try to pull back and you don't give them as much to do. God, that's awful. This is the most that we have given Nyla <laughs> in five seasons. <laughs> While directing. Smooth. And again, that's where the crew having been on my side and that safety net really helped out and picked up the slack when I was trying to wear two hats simultaneously. You know, Sean was there and other people were able to kind of step in. And you know, if you guys hate the episode, you can blame Jessica and Sean not because <laughs> yeah. I wasn't there. Bring Lovely. it. Bring Please. it. <laughs> Where's Bellamy? Clark has now got to tell the people who love Bellamy what happened. That sets up for some of, I think, the most emotional and certainly surprising in, in the way they handle it um, and performances. It does put a bit of a damper on the return to Earth. You know, like they're back on Earth and Earth is back and it's beautiful and yet Elm yeah. is dead and so we can't really celebrate that. Yeah, there's a version of this script where they were really excited to be back on Earth, but now, you know, it's, it's morning going into sort of a, a calm before the final thunderstorm, before the final storm hits. So it's really nice that we get about half an episode to really have characters. And, and coming into the show as a fan of six years of fandom, to be able to put a lot of those final pegs in place with these characters and, and to go through like Echo's story, to get through all these different characters' stories and put a finish on a lot of them is really exciting. And then, boy, about halfway through, does that storm just kind of, it hits from Sanctum, it hits from Bardo, and, and now we are in trouble. One planet will be fine. Thank you very much. I think it's another tour de force by J.R. Bourne. I don't want to transcend. I want to reign. The combination of Chadigan and, and Shadeheda is interesting to say the least. You. Me. Everything that could go wrong went wrong this season, and it's still one of my favorite experiences. Thank you. Bravo to everybody, and thank you. Bravo. Ah!